When you auditioned for Curb Your Enthusiasm, I remember the story that right. uh, you were watching Curb Your Enthusiasm. It had already been on for a couple of seasons, yeah. and you yeah. turned to your wife and you said, hey, I should be on this show. This is good. She right, even right. said it. She agreed. Right. You go in for an audition. You knew Larry from your days writing at Saturday Night Live. Mm -hmm. You walk in and you see Larry standing there for the audition and you walk over and smack him in the face? No. I see. see I do this thing. I tell, you know, I, I, I'll even give this advice to other actors. I always make it a point to, if I'm going for a role, this is what the fuck I do. Yeah. I walk into the room as the character. I don't fucking walk in the room as JB and say, I'm JB Smooth. I'm about to play the role of Leon and then turn fucking Leon on. It's bullshit. That's, that's fucking. See, that means you got to change gears. Now you got to get into your fucking zone. Mm -hmm. Why not get into the zone in the fucking waiting room? Right. Already right. start doing. What the, I started doing mannerisms. I said, I know who the fuck this dude is. Right. Once I read the sides, I said, I know who the fuck Leon is. I know a few Leons. Hell, right. a few. It's a Leon at my motherfucking house. You know what I mean? <laughs> who is Leon? Who is he really? When you when you sat there before you went into the audition, you had read the script or right. the loose kind of idea of what this guy is. Who was Leon? This character that you were about to portray. Leon was a guy. I felt like a guy who lived day to day. He's a somewhat of an opportunist. But he's a guy that got your back. We are in the motherfucking house. You drove the car? <laughs> Look what you did to the car. I'm telling you something. This motherfucking car got some heart, man. I was surprised. I thought it was a bitch ass car. This shit got some fucking heart to it. He's a guy. He's like the condom in your wallet. He's the dude who you would go and take with you to fight a ticket. He's a guy you would go to court with. You know, he's a guy. He's a good would, guy. You would take this dude to help you break up with a girl. He's that dude. He's That's a dude. not you. I don't take JB Smooth to fight a ticket, but I would take Leon. You would ask me, right. but I would say fucking no. JB you know would I mean? be busy. <laughs> I got to do. JB right. would be busy. Leon <laughs> wouldn't have anything to do. So when you but walked Leon into, got your back. When He's you like, walked yeah. into Larry David, you knew who Leon was, and you came in and you proved that. Why? Why did you smack him though? You did smack Larry. No, 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 I never smacked anybody. Oh, but here's what I wanted to relay to the as the character. I said, "Here's exactly what the fuck I said," right? Because I, I don't believe in violence and shit. So what I did was this. I like to walk in the room as the character. So that way, you see how I walk in the room. You see my mannerisms immediately. Now, when I walk into the room as Leon, these motherfuckers, you should have seen the face on these motherfuckers. Everybody looked confused. Like, what the fuck just happened? Who the fuck is this dude? Right. And why is he coming in like this? <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. I could see it in their faces. They were like, they looked at each other like, what the fuck is going on here? I came in there like this. Mm -hmm. They told me, I said, okay, okay, JB, you're going to improv with Larry directly. So I walked up to Larry. This is the fuck I said as character. I said, okay, Larry, let's do this shit. Going to improv, right? <clears throat> okay. Let's make it happen. So I don't know. This is fucking improv. I might fuck around and slap you in the face. I don't know. Anything could happen. Right. Larry's face was like, what the fuck? <laughs> he, looked at the, he looked at the other producers like, get this motherfucker out of here. Who the fuck is this? <laughs> but I wanted that. See, right. I wanted that. See, what that does is this. It allows those producers, those directors, to see the character immediately. Did the they understand what you were doing? They caught on because I, once I sat down and, and, I, and I did my little Leon head tilt yeah. and I did some shit like this. They got it. They fucking started laughing their asses off. Did they and offer they, you the part right then and there? Or oh, did, fuck no, no. They made you wait. No, no, of course they made me wait. But here's the thing that does. They told me after the fact that they didn't know who Leon was. Until mm -hmm. I walked in the room. You had your take on it. And which is great because what that was, it said you didn't even open, they, they told me that you didn't even open your mouth yet. Right. You fucking got it. But that's the power of mannerisms. That's the power of improv. That's the power of not going to that motherfucker with a goddamn plan because you stuck to that goddamn plan. And a plan only works one fucking time. When I go to the bathroom and I sit down on the toilet, my Johnson hangs in the water. <laughs> That's just uh, such nonsense. What are you saying that for? I sit on the fucking toilet. My shit goes under the water. Like like, like this. It's almost like it grabs his, his fucking head. It's just like... You love being on You can't repeat a goddamn plan. No. That shit is it. You got one chance to do that fucking plan. You love you fucked up. You love being on Curb, right? Curb your enthusiasm. Fucking you love it.